Dead plants are delicious. You ever had a, a carrot? Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I'm your humble narrator, and welcome back to Reassembly. My ship is just growing fucking bigger and bigger. <laughs> Where it stops, nobody knows. I think I can fit uh, a couple more thrusters on, and that is perfect. 2018 out of 2019 power. So uh, hopefully it'll it'll go just fine. It hasn't so far. I did add just a little bit more armor to the front, uh, but I think maybe I should I should move my my command module back just a tiny little bit, put it behind those, and maybe uh, maybe that'll be good. Although if the generators get hit, um, we're pretty much done anyways. Oops, <laughs> that uh, disassembled my whole ship. Now we just wait for a little bit of reassembly. There we go. Oh, now we're 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 backwards. My whole ship is backwards now. <laughs> this is not the way that I meant it to go. Oh fuck. There we go. That'll work. One more time. Try it again, boss. <laughs> oh my god. I'm having a good time with the farmer race. It's definitely uh, difficult, but uh, I I think it's rewarding. When you finally get the currency and resources back to the base, it feels like quite an accomplishment. Here's some more uh, some more farmer goodness, farmery goodness over here. Hell's yeah! I'll just snatch this up. Oh my god. Luckily, I do have uh, some backwards motion on my thrusters, so we're able to cut that guy right apart. And you! Aw, oh, shit. Well, that's a lot of resources if I can get back there in time. It doesn't seem so. Damn. As I said, the, uh, the front of the ship is still just a little bit flimsy. I should probably move the command module back somewhat. Um, and I also still need some more, some more power. We don't have enough power! I want to try and spawn my station up here. I'm feeling ballsy. I'm feeling bold. And uh, I got my auto defense laser to deal with uh, the drones of these fucking ships. Which they have many. They have drones to fire on me, and they have drones to repair themselves, so uh, I'm gonna have to be extremely careful. Boom, boom, boom. Destroy him! Oh god. It's okay. We'll cut through, turn back. There we go. That's how it's done. And uh, as long as I rely on my missiles, I'm not gonna run out of power too quickly. It's when I mash both buttons at the same time that I end up in some trouble. How's that? How's that, you little bastard? I'm gonna get this activated before I, uh, before I blow up on something. Oh my god. Please no. Trade, trade, trade. Trade, trade, trade. Oh my. It's scary. It's bad. Well, we got the resources in. That's what's most importantly. But damn. I'm uh, a little scared for my station. I need to go back it up a little bit. Oh. But first, uh, here's some more farmer points. Farmer points. I like it so much. Mmm. 500 resources just like that. Piece of cake, man. And I don't know why I can't turn into these stations. It doesn't under it doesn't uh, make any sense to me. It doesn't understand. That's right. Dayton does not understand. But okay, we're gonna do the best that we can. Here's some more points. I better turn this in before I uh, head back up, lest I get into some trouble. Pardon me. Pardon me. Thank you so much. And we're, uh, we're raking in the, uh, the coin pretty good now. I'm rather liking the, uh, amount of currency that I'm pushing through. 
And everybody's fucking turning currency into me. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We're already back up to 870-something because we got, um, all these barges. Like I said, they, uh, they farm their own currency, basically, even without fighting things. So I just float by them, and, uh, I'm able to, to transfer, make myself a little bigger, transfer a little more, make myself a little bigger. It's a good deal. It's a real good deal. And, uh, that guy apparently doesn't want to give me any currency. That's fine. I don't need it anyways. I gotta go, uh, reinforce that base up there. Make sure the red guys aren't doing nothing horrible. There's the, the little fellas. Aren't they so cute? They're so cute when they're little. I used to be little. Now I'm a fucking monster. <laughs> I don't want to take apart my entire ship um, and put it back together because I want to retain kind of the same shape. I think that would be a, a bit more fun because you can see the evolution of the ships. Oh my god. Gotta watch out for this guy. Gotta watch out for that guy. Nope. I got fucked up. Damn. Those red guys are harder than I thought. We can, uh, modify the ship just a little bit more. I'm still looking for a uh, place to put my, my gigantic shield. I guess the solar panel isn't so necessary. It's not serving the purpose that I would like it to serve. So, uh, there we go. I can put some, some herb, unobtainium struts. And hopefully, uh, keep this all together. Nope. Nope, nope. We'll start that over. <laughs> I fucked it up pretty good. <clears throat> and I also don't really want to get rid of the solar panel. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. Maybe I can uh, pop the back off and increase uh, my size just a little bit more. That would probably be the wise thing to do. So, okay, there we go. It covers the front, but just a little bit. I guess it's gonna be enough. This is my whole goal. Hmm, this can fit better, I think. Make it work, make it work. I'm gonna have to spin it. I'm gonna have to spin it just a little bit. How's that? Not good, <laughs> but it'll do. And then, uh, this one here. Alright, I'll see if I can attach this and how much it costs. Ah, it costs a lot. I think I need even another one. But, I can afford to do it, so that is a nice thing. Finally get my, uh, my station shield up. Alright, so now we can attach some more holes. Yes! Wonderfully done! And, um, hmm, armor would be good. Unobtainium is probably what I want to put here. These little things have a thousand health each. They also support vegetation, so, um, not a bad idea, all things considered. And then I can also put some thrusters on there as well. I think that would be a good idea. Um, let's put three of them. Just like that, piece of cake, and these over here, and then I've got enough to uh, finish up my thrusters on these outside edges as well. So there we go. This fucking ship. <laughs> it's so gigantic, it's getting a little off center because of that shield, but I will live with it. It's gonna do just fine. The shield is... Uh, worth the the sacrifice in aesthetics and hopefully uh hopefully it's gonna be fucking awesome i don't know if it's uh more powered than the other shields that i have i should also probably build the uh the good generators hmm not a bad idea and uh while i do have a bunch of mini guns ready to go I think it would be a, a wise idea to, uh, to diversify. Wow, that's pretty fucking cool. 
You get surrounded and you just go, bah! <laughs> Everybody die! I didn't know that I could do that. That is, that's pretty neat. Wow! That's uh, probably not a winning strategy, but whatever. Who care? Uh oh. Gotta watch out. Gotta be careful. I can't blow up all of my missiles. And it seems like I'm not getting chewed up too much through that shield, so, uh. Definitely worth the investment. It took me quite a while to uh, work up the the money in order to be able to get the shield working. But it is working now. This is quite nice. And hopefully I can uh, destroy this thing with relative ease. There's something in there. It's spawning something. Hmm. Quite curious. I don't know what that faction is. I guess it doesn't matter too much. I'm taking my uh, giant load of currency up to this station to try and reinforce it a little bit more. But uh, I'm quite nervous, obviously. These red guys have been giving me the fucking business. I was like, yeah, I like to feed on them. They're not too bad. I lied. They're horrible. But luckily, uh, I do have my shield now, so I should be able to deal with them. There we go. Took quite a few episodes, <laughs> but uh, I think we're in the groove now, finally. Finally! Jesus Christ! Alright, get that guy. Gotta watch out, gotta watch out. Better not cry. <laughs> Because Dayton Claus is coming to town. Alright. Put in all this currency. Yes. That's going quite nice. Let's see if I can get this big fucker over here. Yeah, that's easy. His, uh, his back is really exposed. That is what I like about the red ships. It's relatively easy to destroy their, their parts as well. Um, and they don't do as good a job as at protecting it as some of the other races. Or maybe it's just the fact that uh, some of the other races are really fast. <laughs> like the bumblebees, uh, they're not extremely well protected either, but the fact that they can just race in and destroy you with, uh, with everything. <laughs> with their little beam swords, but they also have uh, some scatter guns and shit as well. It's quite worrying, to say the least. But we're making it work. We're taking this fucking area over. Take it over! Finally. Gaining a little traction with my, my farmer ship. Not relegated to, uh, just eating dead plants and whatnot. Although dead plants are delicious. You ever had a, a carrot? Some celery? Put that shit in ranch? Yeah, boy. <laughs> I'm still really enjoying the uh, music as well. The music, the crunchy tunes, mmm. It's quite good. Oh my god. There's a mothership over there. But we're, uh, we're doing our, our work. We're getting it all, all ready to go. Oh my god. That's bad. Should probably turn this in before, uh something worse happens. <laughs> and we're back up to uh, 2,000 currency. Which is pretty nice. Let's see if I can yom this guy up. Baboosh! Baboosh! And that's a good 600 currency right there. Or resources. Which is about 300 currency. But I take. I like! I take! Give me that. I need that. Yeah, these red guys are just getting messed up now. Y'all getting messed up now. And uh, we'll get our, our farmer farmer action going over here. So I can uh, just basically float through space and get free resources. Obviously the best part about playing the farmers. Everything goes well. Or it doesn't. <laughs> 
when things are going well, it, it's really great. But when they're not, it's a, it's a fucking nightmare. I got blowed up five times in a row at one of these points. Oh my. I'm gonna need that from you. Thank you. 900 resources. Yes, this station shield is absolutely the, uh, the best idea. <laughs> it was worth the investment, I will say that much. Oh, more motherships. Motherfucker ships! Back up, back up. Stay out of range of the lasers. Very nice. And then I collect my goods. Hmm, not all of the goods. Dang. I need more. Let's go turn this in. Turn it in real quick. Doop doop doop. Oh, that's so good. Got even more already? Holy shit. That'll work. And now we're uh we're spawning extremely well up here. Look at all that. Mmm. Mmm. Alright, let's see what else I can do with my ship. Hmm, I have many things that I could upgrade. Power distribution. I still need to get that generator going. Uh, oh, the longbow. I want to try that out. It's so expensive. And then there's also uh, this madman right here. Explode damage 120, explode radius 90. Well, let's see how that goes. HM1 missiles. I don't necessarily want to detach any of the missiles that I have currently, but uh, I'll try snapping that thing on there. Ooh, it is expensive. It is quite expensive. I'm only going to be able to do one. So, um, where to put it? Where to put it? That be the question. That doesn't work. <laughs> it clogs my missile hole. Hmm. I could pop a missile off the front. I could wait. I could just leave it on the side like that. That's probably what I'm gonna do. And then I only have one of those gigantic bastard missiles, but we'll get some more pretty shortly. I'm sure of that much. It seems like we've chased the red guys out of here pretty proficiently. And I'm proud of ya, big old ship. Yeah, just uh, a bunch of skeletons left around. Ha ha ha! I just need to wait for these plants to mature, and it's gonna be a uh, resource paradise over there. There's a little recon unit. Take me to your leader! Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind, you're dead! Forget everything I said. There we go. That's working out pretty nice. And I uh, see an agent fleet out here. I'm not too eager to fuck with that. But uh, yeah, we've we've taken over a sliver of the universe. It's it's been such a fucking struggle. But it's what we had to do. We did it all. Ha 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 ha. And now uh, I'll just cruise through some unknown galaxies and shit like that. Nobody is over here. I could uh, try to spawn some ships and get it started, but um, my my forces are not that far away, to be quite honest. So I'm not too worried about it. And here we've got more uh, more plants spawning. I just love being a farmer. Hooray! I need to get some more of those barges going. That's what I really want. I keep uh, getting some some currency for exploring new sectors, so that's going to be nice. I don't know what lies on the outskirts. We haven't uh, done much battle with the Crystalline in this series. It's mostly been against the, uh, the Fire Nation and the Bumblebees, but that's okay as well. There's some Crystalline over there. Hmm. Maybe we're headed into the neighborhood. It's a wonderful day of the neighborhood, a wonderful day for the neighbor. 
Would you be mine? Please be mine. Oh, I got some barges over here. That's nice. Hey, hey, hey. Little bastard. Little crystalline bastard. What do you think you're doing? You can't do that. These are my people. Yeah, and this is a, a place ready to be set up. Maybe it was destroyed by an Asian agent fleet. I don't think I've been this far out. There we go. Transfer some more currency. And I'll head down and see, uh, see what awaits me near this station. Seems like more red. The damn Fire Nation. They're out and about, ain't they? Hmm. Explore new sectors, explore new sectors. Everybody likes that. I have so many barges ar around. You guys should uh, transfer me some of your stuff. I want some currency from you. If that's all right with you. And even if it's not, just, just give me. Give me, I need. Well, there's a bad fella there. It's all right. Missiles will take care of it. Oh my. This is uh, not a good place to be. Maybe if I cut to the quick, cut to the core. Well, at least I can kind of uh, hang out in this area now without getting absolutely destroyed. Well, I did get absolutely destroyed, but I stuck around long enough to uh, to get the station back online. Which is the most important part, yes. Just, uh, working my way. Making a life for myself. Let's see, what else could I do? Hmm, swatter, medjum beam. Hmm, beam weapon. I'm gonna try and slap this on somewhere. See how it go. Oh, and then I've also, uh, would like to upgrade. But I can't. Not yet. Oh, that's too expensive as well. I'll have to get some more currency. Oh no! Oh no! And there's some crystalline over there. Oh, those bastards. I gotta go get them. See that blue on the map? I just gotta go get it. I don't know if I can handle uh, what they have. They've got flamethrowers or fucking rocket launchers. No flamethrowers. You can't light a fire in space. That's just science. There ain't no oxygen. <laughs> but they do have rocket launchers, which uh, are probably going to cause a really big problem for my uh, my relatively weak shields. So I just hope that I can uh, get to the center and that everything is going to be awesome. And uh, maybe I should put another shield on before I go. It's hard to say for sure. Yeah, and I probably need a little more uh, generator action as well. I'm having uh, just a little bit of trouble with the farmer race. But alright, we'll, uh, we'll stop off at one of these here stations. I'll drop off my currency. Oh my god. The power also, uh, yeah, is sapped by the shields. Which I don't know if that happens for other races. I can't recall. Hmm. Troubling. Anyways, friends. This has been Reassembly. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I sincerely hope you've enjoyed this episode. And if you have, I hope that you will like, comment, and or subscribe. And if you do, friends, I'll send you a Venus flytrap. They're uh, not anywhere near as dangerous as these horrible, aggressive plants that I have to deal with. But they are quite aggressive for plants. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye